Comfortable with Uncertainty by Pima Chaudron Chapter 4 The Wisdom of No Escape The central question of a warrior's training is not how we avoid uncertainty and fear, but how we relate to discomfort. How do we practice with difficulty, with our emotions, and with the unpredictable encounters of an ordinary day? For those of us with a hunger to know the truth, painful emotions are like flags going up to say, you're stuck. We regard disappointment, embarrassment, irritation, jealousy, and fear as moments that show us where we're holding back, how we're shutting down. Such uncomfortable feelings are messages that tell us to perk up and lean into a situation when we'd rather cave in and back away. When the flag goes up, we have an opportunity. We can stay with our painful emotion instead of spinning out. Staying is how we get the hang of gently catching ourselves when we're about to let resentment harden into blame, righteousness, or alienation. It's also how we keep from smoothing things over by talking ourselves into a sense of relief or inspiration. This is far easier said than done. Ordinarily, we are swept away by habitual momentum. We don't interrupt our patterns even slightly. But with practice, however, we learn to stay with a broken heart, with a nameless fear, with the desire for revenge. Sticking with uncertainty is how we learn to relax in the midst of chaos. How we learn to be cool when the ground beneath us suddenly disappears. We can bring ourselves back to the spiritual path countless times every day by simply exercising our willingness to rest in the uncertainty of the present moment over and over again. I really love this chapter, and I find myself really leaning into it these days, when the uncertainty is high and it feels like there is no solid ground to stand on. I hope you enjoy it as well.